This is a demo video for WBS Gantt chart for Jira. Creating a Gantt chart. To create a Gantt chart, you will go into your app section and press on WBS Gantt chart for Jira. Then you can press on the create Gantt button. You can create a new Gantt from a project or filter. Enter the name and the project. How to use the Gantt screen. On the left side of the screen, you have your work breakdown structure. On the right side of the screen, you have your chart. To create your first project, you can add issues such as tasks, epics, bugs, and stories. First, we'll add some tasks. You can also delete an issue. And you could also edit the baseline. In the view section, you could collapse all your hierarchies, and you can also expand all your hierarchies. You can also view resource view, progress lines, critical paths, and baselines. We'll get more into that later. In the data section, you could export to Excel. You can also export to MS Project, and you can import to MS Project. On the right side of the screen, you could view your charts by hour, day, week, month, quarter, year, and more. Project planning. First, we can add issues to our project. Then we can rename them. You can add assignees. Change the number of units for the task. Set start and finish date. Set the duration. You can also change the columns to fit your project's needs. Drag and drop dependencies. Here is an example of a project. First, expand all your hierarchies. This is an example of a marketing team's task. For drag and drop dependencies, there are four types of dependencies. Start to start, end to end, start to end, end to start. All you have to do is drag and drop. Creating dependencies allows you to see your critical paths which show you which tasks need to be completed first. Setting the baseline. To set the baseline for your project, press on edit, then go into all child issues. The baseline should be set for the entire project. Now you'll see a gray line under each of the tasks. The baseline is a gray line that shows a snapshot of the entire project. You can also edit the baseline for a specific issue. Viewing options. In the view section, you have the option to open resource view, progress lines, critical paths, and baselines. Resource view allows you to see how much of a workload is allocated on an assignee. If the bar is green, it means that the assignee's workload is within the limit or below. If the bar is red, it means the assignee's workload has exceeded its limit. For progress lines, if the lines are protruding to the left, it means that there is a delay in the progress. If the lines are protruding to the right, it means that you are ahead of your plans. Critical paths are highlighted to show you which tasks need to be completed first so that there will be no bottleneck on the project. The baseline bar is displayed in a gray color. To set up a baseline, you will have to go into the tasks and then set the start and end date. Saving. Your project will not update unless you press the save button. After you save the file, you have the option to export your data. Additional features. Template mode. Template mode allows you to clone multiple issues. You can manage your template here. Gantt configuration. On the calendar, you can press the edit button to adjust specific work days. If there's a holiday for a certain day, you can input it here and the day will be grayed out on the chart. Coloring. There are three different options for coloring. Children's bar, parents bar, and baseline. You can change the color of each one. 
We will have a more in-depth video for gank configuration in the future. Alert feature. If the warning is green, it is three days prior to the start date. If the warning is yellow, it has not started yet. If the warning is red, the task is not completed yet. Support. If you want to know more details about WBS Gantt chart for Jira, please see the documentation on our website. If there are any additional features you would need, we would be glad to receive feedback from you and you can also contact our customer support. For more information, please check out the links in the description and if you would like to try out WBS Gantt chart for Jira yourself, please check out the Alassia Marketplace which will also be in the description.